I, I don't know if you know this or not. A Fox Fox and Friends this morning uh, has reported that Whoopi Goldberg, George Clooney, uh, um, John K Jim Carrey, um, Alan Jenner has all support Trump because of his, his because Newsmax reported ten years ago that Donald Trump was supporting gun control. The Newsmax posted the only video up, the only video. Then Donald Trump's words ten years ago that saying that he supports gun control and the holy the Hollywood elite all came on board supporting Trump this morning. They all did. And Fox and Friends has not released this video, but Newsmax has, and since then Whoopi Goldberg has supported Donald Trump and so has John Kerry and so has um uh, um um uh, and, and and so has that George Clooney and Hollywood elite Ellen generous too as well. They have all supported Trump. I just want to bring that out to your attention. And my hearts and prayers are with Ben Carlson because his campaign manager uh, hit, uh, hit a black. He uh, was on a was on a snowstorm like you. Um, hit a uh, hit a patch of black ice. Flipped his car and uh, and uh, fortunately he's. Uh, he passed away, but you know, uh, my hearts and prayers are with Brian Carson. So go ahead, Ron, with your with your thoughts on all of this. Okay, uh, ben Carson's campaign manager flipped his car over on a on a patch of black ice. Oh man! Yeah, right. yeah. So it's twenty five years old. Twenty five years of age too, as well. Wow. Yeah, twenty five yeah. years of age. Yeah, it's 25 years of age. Yeah, it's Ben Carlson. Yeah, so, so this is why he took it. His why he took uh, today and uh, yesterday off for campaigning. He for the for the um and trying trying to send his hearts and prayers with the family. So he's doing the right thing. But there's nothing. Uh, um, Fox News mentioned a little bit of it, but there's hardly any mention of uh, of, of the national press at all whatsoever. All they did was talk about it for a little, for maybe two minutes, and then they went to Benghazi and Hillary Clinton and and Bernie Sanders. That's what the news. That's what the news media is now. I mean, that's just it's pathetic. It's sad. Um, and I want to let you know too that uh, since uh, since uh, uh, Sarah Palin has has endorsed Trump, well, uh, I want to let you know that that myself. Rush Limbaugh, Glenn Beck, and Mark Levin have all come on board uh, in supporting Ted Cruz. And actually, uh, this morning and to, and all this week, ben, uh, um, Glenn Beck is actually going out in the, in, to town hall meetings with with, uh, with with the Ted Cruz right now. So he's actually doing that right now as we speak. So he's actually out there. He's he took his radio program on the road. Um, with uh, with Ted Cruz is what he's done. So I just want to report that because he's actually going to town hall meetings and showing the videos of how many people are going to town hall meetings, how many people are actually supporting Ted Cruz right now, and is driving the liberal out, the dry, driving the propaganda news absolutely crazy right now. They're driving them nuts. And Mark Levin, myself, and Rush have all come on board in in, in agreements towards reporting the truth now uh, because we are seeing on tell we are seeing on on Fox News and all the propaganda on television they're just mil they're trying to uh, put the, all their money and all their advertisement into Donald Trump right now not about the not about the true candidate the true conservative and it's just sad it really is sad to see this and see how and see how this nation is crippling down because of the news networks and this is a violation of the FCC because they're not reporting the truth and that's exactly what the Digital Watch said this morning too as well so there you go I mean, I'm actually been a member of Digital Watch for 20 years uh, 20 years Ron believe it or not a Digital Watch member 20 years now so not since 1996 when Bob Dole and Jack Kemp ran for president, so I mean, it, it, that's what uh, that's what the news is. This is reporting, Ron. You're not going to find this anywhere else at all. So, what's your thoughts are? Go ahead, Ron. Okay, well, uh, I haven't. I didn't turn the television on today. I'm I sure I'm sorry to hear about what happened to Ben Carson's uh, mm -hmm. uh, campaign manager. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Right. 
Right, so anyway, that's what's going on. Uh, that's what's going on in a nutshell right now in the news. That's pretty much it. That's all. That's all we were reporting. Um, that's all. That's pretty much what we have. Just want to get your. I just want to get your intake of all of this what we just talked about. You know what your thoughts are, and what and and what do you think about uh, having? Um, you know, as you know, Bernie Sanders is in the polls right now. It's going, is raising, is 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 raising awareness with, with liberals, and more liberals are supporting uh, Bernie Sanders than they are Hillary Clinton right now. I just want to report that to you too. Uh, you know what, man? That's a matter of ignorance. No. Yeah. That's the only way you can support Bernie Sanders and Mm-hmm. Right. I totally agree with you. So anything else you want to add before I let you go? Anything else you want to add? Um, uh, I'll tell you what. Can you call me back tomorrow? Yeah, I can call you back tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I can call you back yeah, tomorrow. Call me back tomorrow. Same time. I won't have this on my mind. Oh, great. That sounds good to me. Thank you so much for your time, Ron. I appreciate it. No, this is really, this is, it's really important to get, this, to get this out there and get awareness. All we're trying to do is inform and to learn and educate. I mean, is what the biggest the biggest joke right now is having um uh, um as you know the uh, with Bill Riley and also with uh, um, uh, 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 Michael Miller are going on the road the campaign you know the campaign tour. It's just a joke. All it is they're talking about um about about um um I like Ike. And making fun of uh, the of, in the past pre in the in the past candidates, but not but and also exposing um, wh what Obama's doing, but nothing that's really happening to the conservative movement. They're not talking about that on the road or on. They're not doing that. All this is propaganda to build up their uh, the, the build their talking points, but not care about the real issues. It's just sad. It's just sad and I want to know why uh you know of JC Waters has not done a um a, a, a investigation about uh exposing the factor you know he should I mean he has hosted and well, he's you, not going to expose the factor because they're cheating. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> you got you, you said it, Ron. You answered my question. That's beautiful. So we'll talk again tomorrow, Ron. Thank you so much for your time. All right. All right. Bye -bye. Yeah, bye bye.